Richard Richie, good old Richie, against Magnus Carlsen. Here we go. Are you ready, folks? A4. Ta-da. Okay, what's your feeling, Peter? I do not know what this is. <laughs> I have no idea what this is. It's, uh... Um, I mean, we've achieved, like, if we look at the current position, some explanation maybe uh, starts uh, presenting itself, but yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not sure if, if, I, if, I, if, I, if I'm in love with this idea. If, if I, we... think, I think it can be ignored, I think it can also be very well met by 7A6, I'm just not sure what this achieves. The, the funny thing is, if we flip the colors around, then, you know, there are uh, analogous positions in the English where a, a5 with black turns up, um, f well, occasionally, let's put it like that, um, but somehow with white it never gets played. So, well, yeah, it's, it's, it's very, it's very odd and, uh, uh, yeah, I, I haven't really formed an opinion, but it can't be that bad. <laughs> oh, it, yeah, it, it can't be, but I, I also don't know why it's supposed to be so great for white. I think it's mainly just, you know, Richard in particular, I think, very much likes being, you know, unorthodox and, uh, and quirky, you know, yeah. so I think it's very much up his alley just to five we six with a four sort of just because you know because it's there and why not i seem to remember richie has actually beaten magnus before yeah uh i think that was in one of the uh by can say tournaments i mean it back right yeah and and then again magnus has also had uh, i can recall one absolutely spectacular win uh in the time model i think it was where magnus had a beautiful win but anyway let's see so and, and Magnus also very, very curious. Magnus goes like h5, the bishop draws back to t2, and Magnus says, Yeah, I'm not, I'm not putting it back on f6. If you want to play e4, play, play your e4, I don't care. Uh, all of these like little interplays here are very, very curious. And the c6 is a very interesting move as well, because it would appear that the entirety of White's plan is to put it on e5 and say, You can't really chase it away because you have already played a7, a5, so a6 is unavailable. And if you play 6, I'll put it on d6. And then the option gets presented to him, and it doesn't go to d6. <laughs> so, I mean, I'm assuming bishop a6 is probably. No, I'm sorry, no, bishop a6. I yeah. I think he finds the ball out there. There has to be a, a tactical, tactical issue there. Okay, but now we have actually a very interesting situation where, of course, white has this very pleasant space advantage and can potentially use that e4 square. Um, well, perhaps with the queen, perhaps later on with the knight, but first of all, yeah, one has to think about this pawn as well. So it might be difficult for white to arrange stability. Yeah, it's a, it's an interesting position, but it's a position where I think you have to be very, very energetic because your center is somewhat, somewhat under pressure. Uh, rook d8, knight c5, all kinds of things. Uh, uh, on the other hand,
is that if you take on b6, I think queen takes b6 might be the idea, but in fact, I'm, I'm controlling the, 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 the queening square here. I can take this nice goal to 797, and I have bishop f3 in the end. This looks, this looks lost. I can maybe even throw in b3 you know, to make my conversion easier. Uh, so yeah, a, b, a5 on the board. I think g7 will also be played. And maybe Richie will actually have to play knight g2 in that position. But if the knight goes back when the f8 knight is on b, I think we're quite happy to take on a5, which takes a5 with well, b3 even now. Oh, so Magnus, uh, Magnus found an even more concrete way of uh, dealing with the threats. Yeah. You play b3, huh? He's played b3 here. He says, yeah, I don't believe you have any threats. And whereas my threat of just queening my people is going to be very, very efficient. Yeah, this looks crushing. Okay, it's crushing. This, this could be very big for Magnus. Uh-huh. Uh, Yalchish uh, Tabduda in the meantime has to be complete. He will get many. He will get his second win as well. But while he's getting his second win, he will get many of the h1 square. Let's, let's just show that. So yeah. this takes here b7. Rook! Rook, yeah, yeah. Let's go rook. Yeah, that's very much in force. Rook! <laughs> no, I mean, not really. Not really, yeah. Okay, so. In fact, I think he probably just resigns here. I don't I don't see any way to continue because you, you don't really have any threats, and, and b1 queen happens next move. 